first at five, hoping for a smoother meeting. The Des Moines City Council is meeting in person right now. Yeah, protesters forced the last one a couple of weeks ago to end abruptly. KCCI's Chris Gochner is live at City Hall tonight with how this meeting is going so far. Well, it just got started, Stephen Stacy. So far, based on what I can tell from out here, things do seem to be calm. Mayor Frank County is speaking right now. He had just gone over some of the rules for the city council meeting, in fact, relating to disruptions and reminded people that they could face charges, disorderly conduct, and be thrown out of the meeting if there is any sort of severe disruption to it. Let's take a live look inside of what's going on right now. Now, tonight the council is considering a new rule that would apply to the consent agenda, which is usually re uh, reserved for non-controversial items. Under those new rules, only written requests to take an item off would be considered rather than verbal requests. That is, after an item on the consent agenda played a role in the demonstrations at the last meeting, Groups at that last meeting were speaking out against spending $10,000 to send a DMPD officer to a training in Florida. Now, tonight the council will be taking up a policing related measure to hire an outside group to de conduct de escalation training. Of course, previous plans for internal de escalation training were a running theme of speakers at some of the past city council meetings because of some of those officers' backgrounds. The council will also vote tonight on a grant application to extend MLK to East Highway 65 from 30th Street. Back here out live again so far, things appear to be calm. Uh, not many people out here in the overflow area, unlike last time. We'll be back out live here at 6 with another look at how things are going at Des Moines City Council. But for now, live at City Hall, Chris Gothner, KCCIA 8 News, Iowa's News Leader. Thank you, Chris. A big item, as Chris said, on the council agenda tonight allows a third party conduct, to conduct police de-escalation training for the Des Moines Police Department. But the city has removed an item from tonight's agenda to replace thousands of parking meters with a new system. 